So today I'm going to show you my at home system and my on the go system. Now these two planners have worked out really well for me in the last few months and I just want to share my system with you. So my at home planner is an A6 planner. I really love this size. It's not too big and it's not too small and it holds everything that I need. My on the go planner is a pocket XL from Giulio. They're both from Giulio actually. They're both undyed. I absolutely love this leather and I love the way it's going to patina over time. So if you wanna see how I manage my at-home system and my on-the-go system, then go ahead and keep on watching. Bye. Hi, planner friends, and welcome back. So this is my at-home system and my on-the-go system. So I'm gonna do a flip. I do just wanna show you the comparison between the two. They are both Giulio and Dides, and they are fairly new as of this, year. actually no, 2020. They're from 2020, so you can see how the patina is a little bit different on them but they are still beautiful. Like this one's a little bit more blonder where this one's a little bit more of a honey color, but um, they will end up turning, you know, darker within, within time. So first I'm gonna show you the A6. So this is my A6 Campagna Giglio. And this is, oh, let me show you these handmade charms. These are from Lucy Plans Life. Okay. And so pretty. So that's like the speckled and the black. And then this is like, I believe the nude. So you could see that really pretty handmade charm. So these are my husband's initials and this is my A initial. Okay, these two, I'm just gonna lay them here. And I'm gonna tag all, anything that I mentioned today, I'm gonna tag in the description below. So if you do wanna get yourself one of these and then you'll be able to reference back to that. So first, this is my A6, I'm trying to get that in there. Okay, so as you can see, it's very clean, very minimal. You know, I like it. I really am not a, a big fan of color. I actually never was. I really like just really light pastels, very light blush colors, but this is just more me. I feel like it's more simple of nudes. Um, I have some page likes. This is from Paper Panda. And I do want to mention, I do have a coupon code with her. I will flash it here in the video somewhere. It's Planet with Amy, so you could save 10%. Actually, I do have that. If you go to my Instagram, click on my Instagram, and then go to my link in my bio, you'll see my codes for my PR. So I do have a link to Paper Panda if you want to see, if you actually want to save 10% off. You can use my code. So that's from Paper Panda. Also, these stickers are from Paper Panda as well. I haven't had the heart to use them because this palette is just everything to me. It's my aesthetic right now. I love these. These are the transparent stickers. I love that. And look at that. This is just, I love it. So yeah, 10% off, you can use code planet with Amy. I also have some dots here. These are actually from Top Paper Co. And I will link her shop as well. She has really pretty um, minimal stickers. These are from Paper Panda. So this is more of that same palette. This is beautiful. I love the nudes and the blushes and this as well. So you could buy all these a la carte in the shop as well. So I have those back there. Let's see. This is from the Royal Planner. This is really cool. If not now, when? So yeah, just really simple up here. Don't have too much. Um, this journaling card is from Cloth and Paper. This Ollie Clip is also from Cloth and Paper. This really skinny nude pen is from Paper Panda as well. Okay, so this is my word of the year, intention. I 
literally have so much, so many intentions for this year. So I'm hoping it's a good one. That's from Paper Panda as well. Paper Panda. This is from Cat's Presso. It's just an acetate with some clear adhesive sticky notes. This is from Lucy Plans Life. Oh, and the dividers are from Caffeine and Plans. I'll link her shop as well. And if I don't have a code personally for her, I for any of these shops, I will still link some of my friends' codes because I do have several of my friends do PR for a lot of these shops. So I always try to give any kind of coupon codes um, for anything that I show. I just want you guys to get a really good deal. So this is from the Royal Planner. Love this. It's a really thick vellum with like a palette, almost like a Pantone book. I love this. This is also from Lucy Plans Life. Lucy Plans Life. This is, oh, I need to switch this out. Actually, that's a 2020 overview. So this has been my system for, since October. So basically what I do, I date, I date dot important things that I need to do. And then on the sidebar, I write what those coordinating, um, the coordinating dots mean like things that I have to do that month just so I don't bulk up any space here. It's just written on the sidebar. That's October, this is November. November was a busy month as you could see. And then December, this is December. We had a lot of doctor's appointments and a lot of dentist appointments that month. So all these little minimal stickers, I think I have some here actually. These are from Banana Doodle Shop. I use these the most. The credit card one, the, um, this is from Banana Doodle Shop. This is the dentist appointment, doctor's appointment. These are from Planner Monkey. And then these are from High Paper Clouds. So the most used stickers that I use are back here. Okay. Just an inbox gratitude journaling card from cloth and paper. This is also from Lucy Plans Life. It's a photo of my daughter. Oh my gosh, look at this. It's backwards. It says, it's a mask and it says about 2020 on it. Love that. This is my honey and I. And yeah, he's filming everything you guys. So without him, this channel wouldn't even exist. <laughs> Honestly, he films everything and he edits it and He's amazing. I love him. This is also from Lucy Plans Life. So yeah, this is the whole, my whole minimal thing that I've been doing. So it's, I still use stickers, but I don't use a whole ton of them. So really just like the dew drops, number dots. These number dots are from High Paper Clouds. And then just little icons from Banana Doodle Shop. So let's see if I get that more in there. So yeah, really simple. So. When I have time on Sundays, I plan out my week, I pre-label, I put the stickers on, and then you could see when I don't have time what I do. So when I don't have time, I don't decorate it. I don't decorate it. It's just writing and just functional. Like I said, this is just a functional planner for me. So, okay, there's that. So I haven't, I haven't started my new inserts for, I have a 2021 dated for cloth of paper. I haven't started that yet. I know I should. It's, this, is, this is January 2nd, so I actually should. Let me just show you this. Okay. This acetate is from Queen City Designs. This is cloth and paper. Planner Monkey Co. Okay, we're getting into my finances, so I'm gonna see if I can show you a blank one. So this insert I really like. Um, I forgot what, this is like the budgeting insert from Cloth and Paper. So every month I put in my bill trackers and what I'm, this year my husband has given me a, an allotted allowance for paper crafting. So I have to keep track and I thought this would be an awesome insert to keep track of my spending. So I need to stay within my budget every month. I can't go over. So this is just a really good way to keep track of that. So that's all in the bundle. It's, it's like a budgeting bundle from cloth and paper. So this is really cool. This card I got in the sub books like 
a year ago from the honeybee shop and just has a little self-care little reminder so this is i forgot where i got this from i think it's coffee table too but that's from um paper panda planner monkey co queen city designs now this is my favorite of all time bible verse and i was so surprised that lucy plans live had this as a dashboard this is the verse that i live by jeremiah 29 11 for i know the plans i have for you declares the lord plans to prosper you and not to harm you and plans to give you hope and future the fact that it has the word plans on it i thought that's amazing but anyways this is like i love this verse this is like my favorite verse ever so i have that uh so this is just like my ex christmas list that i kept Christmas card list that I kept. So these are just notes, 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 notes. And that's it. Okay, this is really cool. This is from the Royal Planner. She also makes these cool little sticky tabs. This, this is from the Royal Planner as well. And this is just like a recommendations insert that I got in a sub box. So just to eat to see, I really wanna use, them, use this this year because it has a to eat so things that I can eat so my husband and I are doing whole 30 this month so I just I need to really fill this out and things to see like shows it says concerts but we know that's not happening right now um things to learn this is a really cool insert so I really want to use this this year and then back here I just have my stickers that I use the most these are from banana doodles and then appointments this is from wild paper moon Wild Moon Paper. She, I have some other stuff in my other one that's really cool from her. And then these are just some little task cards that my friend Ida made me. I love this. And then this is the Tombow Duo brush pen that I use the most for highlighting because it it's like a perfect nude. Like, it's like a really perfect nude. I love that color. So this is the Tombow 942 Duo Pen brush pen whatever so this is my at-home planner so that is my main planner so my on-the-go planner it's a little bit different so just that the side so this is my on-the-go so I switch out the covers on this one I either have I pretty much only use Julio or Vanderspeck and I just swap between the covers so um, in the newest videos, I'll show you like, just like all the covers that I have. Maybe I'll do like a collection video or something. Cause that's one thing I do take pride in is my, my collection. I really love this. Okay. So this is the Julio pocket XL. So it's a little bit longer or wider. And then the, the rings are like 16 millimeter, 20 millimeter, something like that. I'm not exactly too sure, but they're definitely bigger than the ones that the usual pocket comes in. So you're going to notice that the clasps are missing. I did take them off because for some reason they were gapping really bad. And when I tried to fix it, I took the whole mechanism apart. And when I took them out, they were closing without the little, you know, the little press clasps here. So I just, I took them out because without them, they were just gapping like with them. So this is my on the go planner. So I just have some really cool like die cuts. This one is from Wild Moon Paper. This one, I think it's from Coffin Paper. Oh no, this is from Lucy Plans Life. And then um, in here, this is from Coffin Paper. This is my word of the year. It's intention. Coffin Paper as well. Caspresso Co. This is from Paper Panda. These little page flags I just have in here. So a lot of these dashboards are from either Lucy Plans Life or Wild Moon Paper Co. Let me just confirm that's what that is. Once, yeah, Wild Moon Paper Co. Is, she has a lot of digital. So this vellum is from Lucy Plants Life. This is a digital from Wild Moon Paper Co. Lucy Plants Life. This is just, um, I think from Cloth and Paper and I just put some sticky notes on it some stuff to do. This is like my errands tab. So this is my on the go planner. So this is my 2021 overview. This is from Planner Monkey Co. These dividers are from Caffeine and Paper Co. So here I just have 
writing. I just write. I don't decorate. So yeah, so that's just my weekly overview. And I have this is acetate is from Queen City Design Co. Wild Moon Paper Co. Oh, gosh, I will tag her Instagram. I know her first name is like Maria, but I'll tag her Instagram. And then, so this is my monthly. So really simple. See how like simple it is? And I just, if I need to, you know, mark something important, I just put on a little sticky note. Cloth and paper. I'm not too sure, but I'll tag her shop. It's just some note pages. These are just notes. This, I printed it on vellum. This is also from Wild Moon Paper Co. So these are all digitals that I just printed. This one I printed on vellum, and this is I printed on cardstock. And then monthly expenses. This is where I write down my bills. This is also from Wild Moon Paper Co. And then immediate content. Just some ideas that I have when I'm on the go. And that's pretty much it. The other one is a transaction, like on the go insert from uh, So Much Crafting that I haven't used yet. So this is it. This is my on the go. It's not much. And again, this paper, this paper, this pen is from Paper Panda. I love this pen. It writes so nice. I love these pens. And again, I have a coupon code for Paper Panda. And these are more clips from Lucy Plans Life. There are more custom clips. Oh gosh. Let me get that to focus more. That's really cool that one and then i also have this one this one's really nice too so that's it you guys i hope you enjoyed my setups for my at home and on the go planner and i will see you guys soon bye